Welcome to my vinyl video series. I am taking you through my record collection one album at a time. Today's album is Duke Ellington's Unknown Sessions. This album was recorded July 14th, 1960, but Columbia Records didn't put it out until 1979. Uh, I picked up my copy in 2021, much, much later, uh, at a record store called My Mind's Eye. And when I arrived at the record store, there was a bin sitting like right in front of the door. Someone had just sold their entire collection of Duke Ellington. And I was flipping through to see, because they weren't charging very much. I think it was maybe like two bucks a record, which is great. I'm happy to pay two bucks for a Duke Ellington album. So I was flipping through, I pulled a couple, and I pulled this one because of the album cover. I was, I was, I was just drawn to this paper and rope wrapped piano and bench. And especially because it looks like it's on the side of a mountain, whether this is a set or a reality, I applaud the dedication to such a cool album cover. Going through the track list, we have on side one, Everything But You, Black Beauty, All Too Soon, Something To Live For, Mood Indigo, Creole Blues, and on side B, we have don't You Know I Care, or Don't You Care to Know. A flower is a lovesome thing, mighty like the blues, tonight I shall sleep, dual highway, and blues. Now, Mood Indigo is one of my favorite songs. I originally heard it by Sidney Bechet, um, but the fact that I get to experience it from Duke Ellington on this album as well is very exciting. Came with its own little insert. I still have the receipt from my uh, trip to the store tucked in here. I always like to keep these tucked into my albums. I, I throw them into my favorite album that I purchased from that session. And what we've learned, because I included it, is that I lied to you earlier. When I said I paid $2, I actually paid $9 for this album, which is a little steep for my blood. But like I said, I really enjoyed the cover, so I did pay that much. As you know, if you watched my videos before, that I love record collecting because of the album covers. I love having tangible art. And for me, not knowing what's on a disc when I'm buying it is part of the excitement, it's part of the charm. So I'm very happy to have Duke Ellington's Unknown Sessions. If I can find it on a streaming platform, I will happily share it in the link in the description. Otherwise, recommend trying to find a copy for yourself. Either way, happy listening. Thank you.